Emmett Davis uh, let go after that 2011 season. Um, I read you seriously considered getting out at that point. Was that, was that the case? Well, getting out really considered me. Uh, it's a hard business. Yeah. Um, and it's, you know, that was a sad day. I'm on a recruiting trip. Um, and, and to this day, like, I don't know if you've really coached until you've been let go. Um, I mean, that was really hard. My wife had a job. She loved, uh, the head coach at Hamilton college, beautiful school, um, right around the corner from, from Colgate. Um, and she's literally throwing out the first pitch that day with her softball team in year two, building their program. And, and I, I, I call her and say, I'm driving back from a recruiting visit. Um, that's how ruthless it is. You know, I mean, they don't even tell me before I'm going on this recruiting drive. I turn in my paperwork and then we get let go and I got to drive back and kind of figure out life. And she's down in Florida with her team coaching for the next week, um, trying to figure out, okay, what's next? And I pull out my yellow pad and I, I, I write down every name I know <laughs> in uh, college coaching. And I, I became very relentless. I probably was never very aggressive hunting the next job until I didn't have a job. And I got my, my son's two years old and my wife is pregnant with Lucy. Um, and so talk about uh, some challenges there. You got a two year old and you got a pregnant wife and, and, uh, and, and, and you got to find an income. And that's where, you know, I'm blessed that I'm, you know, well-educated. I can do other things other than coach basketball, but, you know, I found that, you know, to be great at whatever you have a passion towards, I found my passion. I, I, I was, you know, desperate to try and keep coaching. Um, and on the way to my interview in Fort Wayne, I stopped at, uh, at a high school in, uh, in, in Kentucky and interviewed, um, at Covington Catholic, wow. uh, you know, good job just, uh, yeah. uh over by Northern Kentucky. Yep. Um, and you know, their time frame was not going to be as quick as, as we wanted to be able to make a, a, a great decision with that. But, um, man, I, I was really, really blessed to get this situation. It was close to my wife's home in Lima. Um, and that's kind of where the next phase of our life ended up. 